Hello people of the earth and welcome to Quick Save TV. My name is Mike and I am absolutely lost wherever I am. Yes, this is the part number three. We just had the bridge exploding behind us. Not actually a bridge, just the rocks, a whole bunch of rocks falling on our heads and we just safely got away from it. This is part number three of our Skyrim adventures in which we play as the wonderful and incredibly charismatic cat, excuse me, Hajit Jaik. Maik, excuse me. I, I <laughs> Jaik is his twin brother actually. They look exactly the same. But I'm so bored to see the name Jaik in the tab, so I'm just gonna call it Maik. Now, this is... Uh, it is inspired by Maik, you know, in the... in the um, uh, How do you call it? In the, in the original game, you see, in, in Oblivion and Morrowind and Skyrim, there's this cat, Maik, and he keeps telling you the... Uh, hidden opinions of developers on different things, you know, like different references, etc. Very, very funny cat, and as a matter of fact, very, very ca funny character with a lot of voice dialogues. But the point is, the point is, my name is Mike, right? So let's transform it to the Khajitian, right? The closest would be Maik. You know, what's the point to bother with it? So let me just be Maik, and let me be on my way. Yes, yes, you're very talkative, aren't you? Okay. Maik thinks you talk much. Do little. Okay, we're going to use the bow on four. Okay, we're going to get proficient with all this stuff. Spider over there. Oh! Look at this! Oh! Yes! That is indeed an incredible skill. Oh! No, that was a miss. Something is a miss. The accuracy is. Yay! Stupid assness. Why do you charge with a bow? Why do you charge with a bow? I mean, how stupid can you be? It's impossible. Alright. Yes, yes, yes. If you, if you would be so kind to... You stole my kill! Get that. Too many eyes, eh? Whatever helps you sleep at night, bitch. <laughs> Too many eyes now. I'm actually myself an arachnophobe, right? But I kind of overcome it. The easiest way to overcome is to kill the source of your fear, right? So what do I do to overcome it? I just smash them spiders. Not the big and poisonous ones, the small and harmless ones. Because I'm not sure I would be able to tell you the tale if I would be smashing poisonous spiders left and right, right? Know what I mean? <laughs> Imagine, right? Try to smash Tarantula. That's probably not the smartest thing you will do in your life, and probably the last. May very well, well be the last. Okay, here. Yeah, web sack. Okay, web sacks are good. Desiccated corpse is not good. It's not very friendly. But those spiders, them and their weird taste and decoration. How beautiful. Just look at this beauty. This is so wonderful. I remember Oblivion only came out and I had this very primitive computer with 64 or 128 memory, uh, video memory. How much I was impressed, you cannot freaking imagine. Everything looked so wonderful. Oblivion was so beautiful, in fact, it couldn't even run properly on my computer. Now with Skyrim and stuff, you know, and my average computer runs it pretty well on 720p, I'm so satisfied. I remember Oblivion, I couldn't run in 720p, it was not an option, plus I had a 4 to 3 monitor, not a widescreen. Yeah, it's a bear! Wow, it's a bear! My goodness. Maik thinks you stupid. You tell it to Maik? Maik gives you lesson with sneaking. Stupid, Nord. Yes, yes. Okay, I got it! Shut up! S hit. <gasps> S hit. No! Stole my hit, you're such a bitch! Mm. How much does he get on my nerves? It's impossible. Oh my goodness. Okay. We're good here, I guess. Okay. Okay, anything here? I don't remember. No, nothing, I think. Just very, very beautiful landscape. <laughs> My goodness, look at this light. Oh, yeah. That is so fun to play. It's just so beautiful. It's one of the parts, you know, that they just... One of the things that makes the game great. 
knew we'd make it. You knew we'd make it. I wasn't so certain with you on my tail. Oh, the dragon priests. Why do priests... Why do dragons need priests? Yeah, scream louder so that he hears us. There he goes. Looks like he's gone for good this time. Indeed. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. Okay. Better clear out of here. Yeah, nice to meet you too. My Sack of shit. Runs the mill in Riverwood, okay. I'm sure she'd help you out. Mike thanks you. Mike bids you farewell. I will see you in the Riverwood. At some point in the future. But first, we're going to go out and kick some serious ass. Slap some serious butt chicks. Destroy something that is vile and evil. Okay. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, lush environment. Absolutely wonderful. Beautiful trees. Nice road, which no one apparently cares to clean. Or take any care whatsoever. Well, it's fine. It's all nice. All in good fun. Yeah, collapsed fortress. Um, destroyed by the dragon. Which were apparently gone thousands and thousands of years. But now they're back. Doggy dog. For some reason, this dog companion keeps disappearing. Once I actually... I like, once I start... Take him with me. He usually dies within some time. Be destroyed. How many of you? How many of you? How many of you? How many of you? Slap. Lock increased. At least, at least I don't have to fight boars. Like if you ask me what was World of Warcraft experience in the beginning for me, that was fighting boars. No! How dare you? How dare you? You are very strong for a dog. Retreat. Here you go. A new meaning to the wording cats and dogs. Yeah, my magic is low. I understand. But I prefer my magic to be low than health. Ah. Yeah, I wonder who made you such a beast. Was your you know, owner a scientist or whatever? Did he augment your physical abilities? Installed some implants to make you stronger? Eh? Take that. Blood is everywhere. No, 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 that's not what I wanted to press. <laughs> Definitely not. Yes, yes. Get over here. Get back here. Get back here. No, you're not going to run away. No, you're serious. You're going to run away from me. Okay, aim, aim, aim. Fire. In your... What is it? Teeth, I guess. Okay. <laughs> uh, no, I do not want to take you with me. You are indeed very adorable, but no. Restoration has increased. Getting better and better. Okay, let's just go somewhere here. There's a couple of nice keys which we can actually clear out, and they're a lot of fun to clear out. They're kind of easy, except for the one we're going right now, where we're, we're going to die 100%. Why? Well, you know, the second one is nice. The second one is nice. First one, we're gonna clear the half of it. The second one, we're gonna clear whole. Bone chill passage discovered. The infamous, like when when the game just came out, the bone chill passage was the infamous place where the game would crash 100% of the time, no matter whatever the hell you would do, nothing would help. Hello. Aggressive, you be. My things come down. You should. Why do I talk like Yoda? Or try. To? Yes. Nah, that is correct. That's what happens when you're not wearing a hat. You fight better. We got some leather boots. We're gonna go ahead and equip them. Leather boots. Leather boots. Leather boots. This guy was far from lucky. Very far from lucky. Steel sword. Potion of, potion of my inner healing. Okay, we have here copper nonic circlet. That is just what we need to be stylish. Let's sort it by, by armor. I'm gonna wear this one now, for armor. 
I wonder how does he feel while wearing such armor, you know, I mean, he's furry himself. Wouldn't he be protected from this kind of <laughs> temperatures? No? I guess not. Okay, Iron War Axe. Iron Sword. Is there... There was another one. We could go with an axe for now, actually. No, it's... What is it? I don't... I don't see the, the quality of it. Steel Sword. It's about the same. Slightly lighter and it has higher attack speed. We're gonna go with it for now. For now. We're going to use it. Iron Sword. Steel Sword. Okay, Steel Sword. Oh my goodness, the design of it. I don't like it. Oh my goodness, you're so disgusting. I'm not gonna look at you. Heavy armor increased. By reading the book. Getting better and better. Okay, we're not going to go there because I still like living. Still very much enjoy it. Um, yeah. So for now we're going to go somewhere else. Look very stylish in this. Actually, the entirety of the time I was playing the game, I never wore this armor before. It's actually very fancy. I like the pelt on the back. It's, it's almost awesome. <laughs> it's contrasting with the color of his own fur. He should actually be a white cat so that he can increase his camouflaging rating in this game. That would be amazing. That would be really helpful. And this is my alarm. And we're going to go ahead and stop at this point. I thank you so much for coming back here to Quick Safe TV for watching the video. If you enjoyed the video and my commentary, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel in order to support my work and get notified when new content becomes available. You can also like or favorite the video if you would like to support my work even further or tell your friends about me. Have a greatest day. I hope to see you tomorrow at the same time. And bye-bye. Oh!